Hey guys, how you doing today? It's me, Kelly. So we're going to do something fast and fun. I just have some random pieces of paper here. Now you can use printer paper, you can use uh, deli paper, you can use your watercolor paper, your mixed media paper, your tracing paper. You see what I'm saying? Anything that you want, Bristol, whatever. I'm just going to use these because I want this to be pretty fast. And I'm going to take some shaving cream. Now this is so much fun to do with the kids. I'm going to use... Uh, my deco art sprays the media misters and we're going to see how that works and i'm doing it right on here so i'm just gonna a little bit at a time you know a little bit not gonna go crazy and then i'm just gonna take my finger and kind of like spread it around so it's kind of even this is fun it smells like when my husband shaves which is like all the time now because he has that that CPAP machine and he can't sleep so he can't have his beard because it doesn't stay on and uh, yeah, yeah, the problems. All right, kind of looks like whipped cream. You see how we're doing? Now, if you want it to be, you know, if you want to be very fancy and get your, um, you can use your ruler, you can use your uh, whatever and just take this so it's kind of flat back and forth, kind of like your frosting or cake. See? No big deal. I like some of them little holes in there, though. And then I'll just clean it off. I feel like the Sweeney Todd cleaning off my, my razor and knife. Okay. Then what we're going to do is I'm going to spray. So I'm just using some magenta and my mister. And I'm going to go close because I want it to be like, you know, see what it's going to do. Well, that looks good. A little black because a little black never hurt nobody. And let's see if this picks up in a little green on the rest of the white. Okay, so now let's take our piece of paper. Now what we can do as well is we could take the bottom part of a paintbrush or whatever, and we can make swirlies all around, whatever you want, swirling, and I'm swirling, all right. You can use your, um, oh, you can use your, what are they called? What are those uh, index cards, index cards. I couldn't think what they're called. Uh, you know, and do this on that as well. So ATC backgrounds, the whole thing. So I'm gonna lay this down and I'm gonna lightly press it. And then I'm gonna lift it up. Ooh. Look at that. So I'm going to scrape that off in a minute, but I'm going to move it. Leave it sit there. Now I'm going to spray a little water. I don't exactly know what the water will do. It looks like it's going to make it like an alcohol ink consistency. If I could get water out of my thing here. I'm going to fill up. Why not? In the middle of a video, do you have to fill up your water bottle? I forgot yesterday that it was empty. Okay. Now we're in business. Okay, so I just want to squirt some water because I want it to be a little runnier. I'm not going to play with it anymore. I like that like that. So I'm going to take another piece of paper and I'm going to lay it and tap it. So you're just running over it very barely with your hands. Ooh, yeah. Look at that. So much fun. All right. Oh my goodness. So fun. <coughs> I'm gagging on the, I'm gagging on it. <coughs> That's how much fun it is. All right. <laughs> don't ask. It's better off if you just don't ask. So really cool. So that is so far the sprays, but I'm going to use a couple paints, just the same. We want some runny paints. And what that means is we want some fluid paints. So I'm just going to grab a yellow, a red, and an orange and one dark color. What about this color? So I have my Deco Media uh, fluid acrylics in ultramarine blue, in Hansa yellow, in primary magenta, and in cadmium orange. And I'm gonna shake it. And I'm gonna. Yep. I'm gonna. Come on, buddy. There we go. Just gonna do that. Some blue. A 
some yellow. So we're almost doing our own jelly print, aren't we? Our own jelly plate with with um, shaving cream. Now next time I'll have to play and see what we could put in there. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to set these aside for a second and then we'll clean these up to see what we get. Okay. Keep those right there. Take the back of our paintbrush or whatever you have. Look at this. Look. Oh, how pretty. Oh my goodness. I'm going to drag it somewhere over here so we get it everywhere. So it's going to kind of be like paisley, right? All right. So I did that. Let's see what we pull up. I'm going to lay it down. Obviously, I did not lay it even on there, but that's all right. Push it. Lift it up. Ooh, yeah. Look at that. Awesome. I'm going to lay that down, and I'm going to take one more print. A couple pieces of paper. Now, I wonder if I put a stencil on this, if then I could print off of it. Let's try it. I get so excited. I'm like, oh, All right, but we have to find a stencil. <laughs> I'm looking for a stencil, looking for a stencil. Of course, they're all over there. Oh, I smell my sauce upstairs cooking. I can tell you that. All right, I'm coming. I'm coming. I'm coming. All right, just a stinky stencil. All right, you'll do. You'll do. You'll do. Okay. Now, I just got this stencil. Don't know if this is going to do anything, but why not? And I'm going to place it down. And I'm going to tap it just a little bit, just so it connects with it. Okay, now I'm going to take my paper, I'm going to lay it down, and I'm going to lightly tap. I don't know if this is going to do anything, but we'll see. Okay. And lift it up. <gasps> Look how cool! Look at that. Of course it's words and it's backwards, because I'm forever backwards. <gasps> how cool! How cool! Oh my gosh, that was so much fun. Let's try another one. Let's try it this way. I'm gonna press a little harder just to see if it does anything different. And then I'll clean up and... Okay. Oh gosh, look at that. Look at that. It's like a jelly print, except it's giving us texture. Oh, what I'm gonna have to do tomorrow and play with, because I just got tons of ideas to do, so. I'm going to clean this up and then I shall be back. Okay, so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to scrape. I'm just going to use this, but you can use a credit card or whatever you have. I don't know where all my scrapers are, so we're just going to, well, maybe I'll use this. Maybe I'll use this. Maybe it'll be easier. Okay. I'm going to scrape this off. Oh my God. Look at this. Look at that. Now, look, you can put this on another paper to get the color if you want, um, so you don't waste it, but come on. I don't, let me see if I can use this paper here. Oh my God, excitement, excitement. All right, so I'm gonna go like this. All right, so it kind of looks a little dark, but that's all right. Look, when you wipe it off, like you can use this many times over. This is like a jelly print. Oh, this is, my mind is going crazy. I'll be doing videos with uh, molding paste tomorrow with this, but look at that, that's just, all paint that we used. Look at that. And you get great backgrounds and prints. Okay, I'm not going to play around with that too much because I will boil the poop out of you. So that's left. So you can definitely use that on. And look how I'm coloring this. So look at this. Look at this. That's all the paint. Oh my God. Can you imagine that on the back of a freaking ATC card? Look at this. Now that's that. Let's see what this does. I'm going to scrape this way. Yeah, you might not want to use a dirty thing, but you're still going to see. Look at that. Oh my god. Oh, it's just delicious. Let me grab the other ones. That's the other one I did. I have so many of them here. All right. Let me move this one out. 
Let me put this one now. All right, I'm gonna do this one first. Oh, wonderful. Look, look at that delicious background. Oh my goodness, okay. Let's do this. I, I, I'm, in, I'm in so much joy right now. I can't wait to play again. I already, I already got in my head what I'm gonna do. Look at this. I'm just scraping off with a piece of scrap paper. So it's not even like I'm, you know, really using a good card or anything. I mean, this is like all stuff you have at home. You can use food dye as well. Food coloring. Look at this. <gasps> all these backgrounds. I will, I have food coloring tomorrow. I'll try it with food coloring for you guys, because I know you guys like to, to know. So this is this one. You guys like to know other options, and I, I love doing other options. So I'm gonna squirt, scrape this. <gasps> Look at this. Come on, are you serious? Now, if I take this, and I'll do it on the back of this paper. Do it on the back of here, and just rub it, right? And then scrape it off again. You get. See the, grad the gradients and all the different colors? Oh my goodness, fantastic. So I'm just gonna wipe this off. My card. Woo, messy. It's all right though, it's fun. That's what I love to do. I need to be messy today. <sighs> okay. So see, we got that. Look at that. Perfect. Perfection. Okay. So let me show you these up close. And personal. So this is this one. And I'm just going to rip these up for uh, mixed media backgrounds. Look at this one. And these are the word ones that are like backwards. I wanted the smaller, you know, see what the smaller ones like. So these came out really good. And then my favorite is this. Look how blue that came out. Look at that. Nice paisley tie-dyed. I am in love. In freaking love. Can't even tell you how much in love I am. Because I don't even think I could say how much in love I am with this stuff. It is awesome. So, if you like this, give me a thumbs up. Please share it around. Um, so you can share me around a little bit. And um, if you guys do this, let me know. Tag me. Like I said, I'm going to have another video coming up where I'm doing, I'm going to use something else to do this because I just had like the bestest idea in the world with uh, modeling paste or with, um, uh, oh crap, what is it called? Oh, I can't even think of it right now, but I'll do a video with it. It's sitting over there on my shelf. So, I mean, come on, look at this. It took nothing. This is gorgeous. Gorgeous. Oh my gosh. I can't even stand it. All right. I'm done. I get so excited over these things because this is great fun that you can have at home. Uh, summer's coming for the kids. You can sit out, go to the dollar store and get the shaving cream for a buck and whatever paint you have. You can even get paints at the dollar store. Um, you know, so you could sit and do it with your kids, your grandkids, your nieces, your nephews, your neighbors, whatever. Or if you're like me and a big kid, you sit and do this kind of stuff. And now we cut it into, imagine if this was on this ATC, how gorgeous. This is going to be a background for me though, but love, love, love. If you guys like this, please give me a thumbs up. Love you guys. And as always, please remember to be kind to each other. You never know what battle somebody else is fighting. Love you guys so much. Bye-bye.